Right. Please look around. Don't break anything. <laughs> Later, dude. Come by often. That skeleton shopkeeper with the golden cat. What's up, Bone Daddy? Oh, you know, just getting by, taking it one day at a time. You know how it is, right? I mean, we're not creepy skeleton monsters, but yeah. 
otherwise we can relate. And what, pray tell, are the two of you doing deep in these haunted woods? We're helping our friend Marion find out who put her under a spell. M marion you say? Oh, geez, I never heard that name before. I is it a name? You're hiding something, aren't you? Fine, you've got me, I'll talk. But only because you've been loyal customers, and I respect that. Back when I was more of a super villain and less of a purveyor of fine goods, I tussled with the Lee brothers a few times. Let me guess. You kidnapped Marion to get their attention. Well, that was generally how it was done back then. But she taught me a real lesson. I could still feel her fist in my gut. Ooh, indigestion. Did you put a spell on her? I would never. I mean, maybe back then if it had occurred to me, but it didn't. So now I just sell trinkets and impulse items. Speaking of, are you two in the market for any snacks, appliances, or rare forbidden treasures? Nope, unless one of them can get us through these vines. Ah, for that, you'll need ghost peppers. About six, I'd say. What's a hot pepper gonna do to magic vines? No, a literal ghost pepper. They're the ghosts of peppers prematurely eaten. This town is so strange. Indeed! I saw some ghost peppers floating around here quite recently. I'm sure you could find some if you look around. What is this place? It looks like some kind of skeleton market. Because it is! Welcome to the skeleton market. I just said that. I know, you're very perceptive. Enter, if you are true of heart. Ah, you found it. Fascinating. Fascinating. Ah, you found it. Fascinating. Intriguing. Peculiar. Curses. If you aren't killed out there, please come again anytime. Ooh. You're that skeleton who greeted us when we first arrived. Tis true, tis I. You're not going to talk like that the whole time, are you? Well, I like to bring a certain level of panache to my salesmanship, but if you're not having it, I can tone it down, sure. What is this place? We sell unusual goods, ones you would never find in a traditional market. Our local pawn shop has a lot of weird things for sale. Well, yes, maybe a bit of overlap there, but can they beat our prices? Probably. Oh. Well, we were forced to set up shop here after the Witch Blair banished us in the most inhumane manner. Well, you're not human, right? No, technically, but people could still act a little kinder towards the skeleton vendors. What's worse is Blair stuffed my tarot cards into a t-shirt launcher and shot them out across the woods. I'm near powerless without them. We can help you find them. What? No, we've already got too much on our plates. Oh, glorious. They should be nearby. Look for glowing floating cards. Find them all and you'll be repaid in both goods and a very big smile from yours truly. Great, looking forward to that. Come on. We'll find your playing card, skeleton guy. I'm not sure, just keep looking. Hey, sir! This here candy is as sweet as you. A mighty fine choice. Well, ain't that the sweetest thing? A mighty fine choice. A mighty fine choice. Mighty fine choice. Stop by again anytime. <laughs> beep beep boo. Video games here. Eject. See you soon.
know that voice. We're leaving. Stop. Be nice. Nope. I am not putting up with one more single minute of... Mihoko! It's so good to see you. Likewise! What brings you two out here? You know, beating people up, taking back our usual hangout spots from the Yakuza. Same as usual. Totally! Where's your little dog? Oh, Molly McMuffins? She was being naughty, so we had to... get rid of her. As in, like, get rid of her? What? Oh no, of course not. I gave Molly to my sister, but that's part of a broader life change. I'm into cats now! That's why I'm here at this cat cafe! This is hell. Only problem is, the cats all escaped! Will you two help me round them up? Mm, spoke too soon. This is hell. Now we're in it. We can help you out. What do these missing cats look like? There's 20 of them, each with the sweetest, cutest, rudest, little, squatchy face. We got it. 20 missing cats. On it. I got things to spend it on. Hey, come on back whenever, yeah? Yes. Come back and spend more money. Found a cat. Maybe we should keep it? No. Another one. How many of these things are there? 